some time in here. And then I came up with an idea for an infinite dispenser. So, nothing in here. Let's just get rid of that. There's nothing in here. Put this on. And it dispenses diamond blocks. Go back in. There's still nothing in it. And it's too many item unlimited, which means whenever you place one, it just turns into 64 and automatically refills itself. So, what happens here is when you flip this lever, it goes under the slab to two places. The first place it goes is all the way underground over here into the back of this block, which turns this red tone torch on because um, under there, over, hold on, I think it's stupid. Okay, over there, there's an inverter under there which turns this on, which turns the redstone torch off. So when you flip it, then it turns this off, which turns that on, and then it turns all this on, and then that turns on right there. And then turns this back off, and that keeps happening, and then it pulls this back into itself, and over to here. Now, it's not always accurate, but it works, which is what I was going for. It pulses into all these dispensers, which shoot into the water stream, which go into the hopper, which goes into the dispenser below it. Now, the only problem with the design right now is you have to break both sides and replace it. Um, I don't know how to fix it because I'm not an expert at redstone like Seth Bling is. He's really good. Uh, um, I'm decent at it. So the second place that this goes is into the back of this block, which is an inverter, which turns it on, and it pulses into the back of this pulser. The same thing happens as over there. And then it pulses into the back of this, and then it shoots it out. So. Let's just fix this over here. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, see you guys later.